Once the sun sets on a thoroughbred's racing career, the Thoroughbred Retirement Foundation finds a new home, a mission, and a purpose for these equine athletes. Chestnut Hall is TRF's local farm and prospect. They're gearing up for their second annual golf event to raise money for their programs. Joining me to discuss uh, all the events that are happening and ways that you can get involved and support it is Ted and Robin Mazarek, ambassadors for the Thoroughbred Retirement Foundation, along with jockey James Graham. It's a pleasure to have you all here. My goodness, it is the season and we, we celebrate our horses and our athletes, our equine athletes and our jockey athletes here today. But it's great to have you all back. And I mean, just what wonderful work you all do out there. I think Thank you. And it's not just at Chestnut Hall. We should remind people, you all are all over the country with these programs. Yes, we are. Robin can mm -hmm. talk a little bit about the foundation. Yeah, we have 15 sanctuary farms across the country. Eight of them are second chance programs and in penitentiaries where inmates that are in their last year of incarceration have schooling and classes. They learn trades and they are offered help with finding employment. Mm -hmm. when, when it's a leave. life changing program. It I is. mean, talk about giving somebody a chance to learn a different trade that maybe when they are released, they have something to go to, a purpose as well. Mm -hmm. And it's beautiful because it's a purpose for the horse too. It is, it is, it's, it's great. We have over 400 uh, retired thoroughbreds. I can't go on to second careers across the country. Mm -hmm. And all the funds are used to take care of them and the sanctuary farms that they live on. Wonderful. Yeah. Uh, and this event, the golf scramble that's coming up, it's just one way to kind of keep mm -hmm. all the programs going because we know that we don't own horses, horses own us, is what my dad always said, <laughs> yes, right? It's and he's true. like, do you know how much hay, hay costs and grain and da da da, da. It, it is. Yeah. And, and you want them to have a wonderful retirement. Yes, and that's what all this money goes to with this so, uh, golf scramble. A lot of folks don't realize horses will run for three or four years and then they retire. Some can move on to a second career, mm -hmm. being a, a, a jumping horse yeah. or a pleasure horse. A lot of them can't. Do they have injuries, so they need to be taken care of till they're 25 or 30 years old. So a lot of money goes into making sure they have a good life yeah. after they get off the racetrack and provide entertainment for us. So the golf tournament is a way to raise funds here in Kentucky. We have roughly 95 horses here in Kentucky that need a lot of care. Mm -hmm. So thanks to James and uh, the jock agency and the group of jockeys here and our great sponsors, uh, we're putting on our second annual event, May 7th at Neville Mead Golf Course. Mm -hmm. oh, and course. we're excited to, to have everybody come out and play. All right, well James, how did you get involved with this group? Um, you know, um, my wife, she, she said that there was a golf tournament and I ride thoroughbreds for a living. Um, the horse, I have a couple of retired thoroughbreds at my house. So, you know, it's trying to give back to them, to look yeah. after them after their career is done. and, and We've, we've rode with a couple of them and they've been fun and my wife rides rides one right now and you know she's she's having fun with them so for us to give back to the business that has helped us in our careers is such a wonderful thing and these guys just keep pumping the thoroughbred retirement for oh, they so do. We, all, we all try and keep helping them you know yeah they give they give to you when you need to cross the finish line it's yeah. time to get back right <laughs> yes exactly so uh, it's, uh, and there's so many ways if you don't even want to play with the golf scramble i think there's ways to what support the auction yes. sponsor a hole how can yes. you be involved so uh there'll be a sheet on the screen i'm hoping that will list uh how to get on mm -hmm. and either donate or be a sponsor and certain level sponsors can actually get your logo on nice. the jockey pants. Oh, nice. Uh, and then James or Declan or Joe Rocco will wear them in a race the week after Derby. So uh -huh. if you want to come out, uh, we'll put you in a box on the finish line. You can golf, you can get your logo on the jockey pants mm -hmm. and just help so these great. thoroughbreds have a wonderful life after they retire. Wonderful. Well, there's still time to sign up, get involved, yes. uh, to do all that, donate, register. Uh, get involved in this program, just go to donorbox.org. Thank you all for coming in. Thank you so much. Pleasure Thank you. to see everybody. Thank you.